What is going on guys? Welcome back to another Team of the Season Club Showcase. Well, it's just basically a club showcase, not really a Team of the Season Club Showcase. But anyway, I have some new Team of the Season players in my club. Now, I'm going to be trying to do a little tactic here because... Uh, well, I'll get into that later on in the video. If you guys are looking for a cheap, reliable place to get you coins, check out battle.com. The link will be in the description. Use the code ETAN to get 5% off. Best time to buy your coins is today because tomorrow is most likely the Premier League team of the season. That shit is going to be expensive. And if you pack any of the Premier League players, they'll be going for millions. Not just like the team of the season most, most consistent. They'll be going for millions. I'm talking about, you know, Aguero. I'm talking about Torre. I'm talking about some really high rated players. But anyway, here we go. So basically, I kept a couple of players that I have reviewed and I've bought a couple of players that look awesome and I um, just want to keep them for the club. Now, some of the players I really want to buy, like su such as Team of the Season De Rossi and Team of the Season, um, well, Motta as well, because they're both Italian. I might not actually buy them now and I'll get into that in just a second. Now, before I begin, let me know in the comment section below which team of the season players you have decided to keep in your club forever. Make sure you let me know in the comment section below a team of the season player that you have bought and you managed and you and you thought, no, this guy is just too good to sell, I'm gonna keep him. Now to be to be honest with you guys, you would have already seen my review of Gignac late, uh, earlier on today, and I thought I would keep him because look look how much I bought him for. Under 30k. Seriously, this guy is a team of season player gold and he has some pretty awesome stats and I thought there's no point of selling him and he's decent. He's one of my uh, more favorable uh, League One strikers so I thought I would keep him. Uh, I'd rather have him than Gomez to be honest with you guys. So uh, you'll see a couple of informs that I have kept because they didn't sell when I was trying to sell all my, um, my all my informs before team of the season. So I thought might as well keep them. So as you guys can see, we have kept a couple. This guy, I didn't even bother selling him because he's very rare and I just want to keep him because he's one of the best League One left backs in my opinion. Also, guys, look at this. The Silver Ibrahimovic, Kim Shin Wook. Definitely decided to keep him. Born for 103k. I think he's gone up by now. But he is 6 foot 5, 99 strength. What better strike could you ask for? Other than his shit dribbling, this guy is basically the Silver Ibrahimovic without the skills and without the dribbling. So, if you're into these sort of strikers, definitely get him because I love them. And a lot of people really like him. But some hate him, I guess. But it's more of a love or hate relationship with Kim Shin Wook. And I'm one of the players or one of the people that I actually really, really enjoy using him. Rossino, this guy, I bought him because I might make a silver Italian team. And I want to make one of the best. And this guy has some beastly stats on his... Uh, look at his in-game stats. This guy has amazing stats. I bought him for a 32k. And I really like his stats. And I thought... Um, Italians don't have many right mid right midfielders, so this guy looks one of the better players until Serie A team of the season is out, which I'm going to be keeping a lot of those players. But anyway, look at this guy as well, Serie A silver player, looking like one of the better midfielders in the whole league, because this guy has some pretty awesome stats, and I bought this guy because he seemed like a pretty awesome central defensive midfielder, so he will work in that team. But we'll see if Team Season Vidal and Team Season uh, Pogba get one. But I just kept him because he is in Serie A. Now, I also bought another Team Season player. Let me just find him. A couple. Here is another Italian left back. Obviously, his stats don't look that great. But I think when you put him in game, he's like a 74 overall player. But anyway, I never got him. Um, I got him for like cheap, like 8.9k so why not buy him he's Italian put him in there and make the best uh, Italian bronze team and also we got Hausawi <laughs> Omar at Hausawi uh, basically this guy I bought him for 10k the only reason I bought this guy is because he is Arabic that's the only reason and um, seeing an Arabic player in team this season, I had to buy him. So that's all. The, that's the only reason I bought him. Now, many of you will be thinking, what happened to De Rossi? Why didn't you buy uh, Cersei and why didn't you buy Motta? The only reason I never bought them is because team season Serie A, I think uh, Motta, I mean, sorry, not Motta, De Rossi and Cersei are going to be in that. So I don't think I want to buy them just yet. They might go down more. They might go up during team season Serie A. It's, I'm taking that risk. But also, Motta might be in the League One team season so I am holding off until that is out as well that's the only reason I never bought them but I will be 
in future. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd really appreciate a like. Sorry about um, not showing you my transfer list because I had to just take away all the transfer list because there was I opened so many packs during that week and there was no space to sell the players. So I had to just take all the players out and then start selling them very, very quickly. But make sure you let me know if you would like to see me on a weekly basis show you my new team of the season club because I, I will be buying players to keep every single week. So make sure you let me know in the comment section below if you would like to see